ago when the world was new. But the birds in the world were gray. They didn't have any colors on their feathers. And one day, the great bird, who was the king of all the birds, called all the feathered creatures of the world together. They came hopping and flapping and cheek chirping and tweeting and cawing. And they were very curious to know why the great bird had called them together. The great bird said, I have called you all together on this warm spring day to show you one of the wonders of the world. And at that, the birds looked up into the sky and they saw the sun peeking through the clouds. And then, wonder of wonders, out of the clouds was a beautiful rainbow. It swooped down through the sky and all the way to the earth with the colors red and orange, yellow and green and blue and indigo and violet. Oh, said the birds, that is the most beautiful thing that we have ever seen. It's splendid. It's magnificent. Oh, if only we could be as colorful as that rainbow. And the great bird nodded and he said, you shall be. I will give one color to each of the birds. You may choose the color that you want to be in. I will give you one of the colors from the rainbow. At that, the bird started squawking and flapping and chirping and pushing with their wings and clawing and trying to get to the front of the line. And the parrot shouted, green, green, I want green. And the cardinal yelled, red, red, give me red, give me red now. And the blue jay said, jay, jay, blue, I will be blue, blue, blue. And the canary, the little canary, chirped and tweeted and said, yellow, yellow, I will take yellow. All of the birds had the most beautiful colors. But there was one bird who was sitting quietly to the side. And when all the birds had their colors, the great bird looked and he said, Wait, Macaw, why did you not come and claim a color when I called you? And the Macaw said, I was waiting my turn. The great bird said, But now the rainbow is gone. All the colors have left. And the Macaw looked very sad and he said, Will I always be gray then? And the great bird said, no, you should not be gray. You were politely waiting your turn. You were not pushing and shoving to get to the front of the line. You were not cawing and, and clawing and flapping your wings to get into the front before all the other birds. You should have colors too. And so he called all of the birds to line back up. And he said, I will give you one color from each of the other birds. You shall be red and blue and green and even bright yellow. And at that, the macaw turned around and he was suddenly one of the most glorious birds of all. And all the birds gathered around the macaw who had been so polite and had waited his turn so patiently. And they all agreed that he was the most beautiful bird of all the birds in the world.